One of the great things about Lightburn is the granular control you have over every setting and the creative effects you can achieve by pushing these settings outside their standard use cases. For example, line interval is normally used to change the distance between scan lines of an engraving so that they just touch each other and give you perfect fills. But you can push them even further apart to achieve a striped shading effect. And if you also change the scan angle, you can give the lines a bit of a slant. This style of shading not only looks cool, it's also extremely quick to engrave, so it's a great way to cut down on job time. You can also layer up traces of an image, each with a different threshold value and scan angle, to achieve a cross-hatching effect, which gives you greater depth and contrast. Then there's the Kerf Offset setting, which is generally used to compensate for the thickness of the laser beam, so you can cut out perfectly sized parts. But you can also apply it to a sublayer with a large value to create extra borders and cut lines around shapes. Combining these techniques allows you to create interesting effects without having to do a lot of design work, and they're a fun way to fancy up an otherwise simple design. We've gone through a couple of tricks here, but there are many more. See if you can work out how we've done some of these, and let us know in the comments. If you have any of your own hacks for settings in Lightburn, we'd love to hear them. So pop those down there too, and hit subscribe for more tips and tricks.